Well, Kyrie, starting today, there's an increased police presence over at Bowie State University, similar to what we're seeing here at Morgan State that I told you about earlier this week. Now we're learning just how effective these new measures may be. We look at terrorism as a big boogeyman, but a local gunman coming onto your campus causing harm is also a boogeyman that they want to protect you from. WBAL News Radio host TJ Smith is a retired law enforcement commander who spent 20 years on the force. He's weighing in on Bowie State University's enhanced safety measures announced Friday after two 19 year olds were shot on campus. We are programmed to look at these campuses as these open spaces, but we're unfortunately in a different world now. And we have people that want to harm other people or don't care if they harm other people while they're looking for someone else. The university says starting this weekend, armed security guards are in place 24 seven, scanning every car's license plate. Gates are closing early with ID required for entry. They're updating the electronic emergency system, enhancing surveillance cameras with facial recognition and installing more automatic locks and card readers for access to buildings. But a lot of what they're putting in place, this isn't this groundbreaking technology that they don't experience on a regular basis. Also under consideration, an AI weapons detection system, more fencing, shot spotters, metal detectors, LED lighting, and active shooter training. At the end of the day, when you look at all of the different measures that are being put in place, every single one of them are deterrents. They're trying to deter people who think that this is a soft, user-friendly space to come and commit criminal activity. And if it becomes more difficult, then they're not going to choose that space. In relation to the Morgan State shooting, investigators are looking for 18 year old Javan Williams. He's considered armed and dangerous. BPD is offering a $9,000 reward for information that leads to his arrest. While Maryland State Police are offering a $2,500 reward for information that leads to an arrest in the Bowie State shooting. Classes are back in session here at Morgan and resume at Bowie on Monday. Live at Morgan State, I'm Tommy Clark, WBAL TV 11 News.